Okay, so what we have here today is a antique Regalite model 457 carbon arc lamp. And this one was actually an eBay find. And um, it's not in the greatest condition, but it is complete and it's not damaged unlike the um, the Fisher arc lamp over there um, <clears throat> and again I can't find much information on this um, I did find a, a couple auctions online on other sites that um, list it as a theater spotlight but given that there is no reflector I'm le it's leading me to believe that this is yet another um, quack medical device for um, exposing people to UV rays but this is a um, single arc lamp um, so it would probably possibly have a um, more concentrated output than say the Fisher which is a twin arc lamp um, but this one is complete it has the stand uh, mind the crap on the floor I'm still in the process of cleaning things up but <clears throat> anyway let's take a look at this it's got a nice heavy cast iron base on it and probably the largest cloth covered cloth and rubber covered cord that I've ever seen and um, which is completely shot you can see like even the um, even the plug itself is falling apart but yeah so that's gonna need replaced and rewired this thing has a massive ballast on it you can kind of see the coils in there are wrapped around some pretty hefty um, porcelain insulators and then here we have the power switch which is a Perkins 10 amp 250 volt switch we can see if we can focus on the Perkins logo there and this is a just a standard old-fashioned rotary switch on and off and then we have the wires that are I think this is the only insulation left on them um, going to the carbon holders and if we look inside the lamp itself this one is a little bit more um, Well, it's actually simpler than the Fisher lamp, but it's probably better than the Fisher lamp um, in the fact that you can manually control the arc by there's a knob on each side, which, let's get focused, which turns the carbons in and out of the holders. And that one there, there's something in the tube what I'm not sure yet but and um, to strike the arc you simply push the knobs together and you can strike the arcs they pivot and there's that spring going across the back um, but yeah stay tuned and we'll work on um, electrically restoring this with some new wiring and see if we can get this sucker fired up. So there we have it, a Regalite model 457 from I have no idea what year. There is it just says patent pending. I can't even look up a patent on it. Um, but yeah, if anybody has any information on this lamp, let me know. Thanks for watching.